And still at the coast, the Seafarers Union of Kenya has hailed the government for its effort to revive the maritime industry in the country. The union's leadership say the move will tap into the huge potential that exists in the sector and to a large extent the blue economy besides creating job opportunities for the millions of youth in the coastal region. Seafarers in the country have commended the government for seeking to revive the maritime sector which had been adversely affected by the COVID-19 pandemic. Speaking in Mombasa, the leadership of the union, led by General Secretary Steve Owaki, says the agreement between the government and the Mediterranean Shipping Company has seen over 500 Kenyan youth land employment aboard MSC cruise ships. Ile kitengo cha serikali kinachohusika na ubaria kimekuwa na mchango mkubwa sana kwa pande wetu kama mabaria. Waki said it was the right thing for the country to allow crew change in the port following the global lockdown brought about by the COVID-19 pandemic. Mabaria wetu wa Kenya kilio chetu kikubwa kimekuwa ni kazi. Sinikweli mabaria? Kimekuwa ni kazi. Na sasa wakati tunataka kupata uo msaada wa kazi alafu mtu anaanza kuleta siyasa the union's chairperson Mwalimu Chi Hamisi said they are committed to ensuring that they work closely with the government for the benefit of all Kenyan seafarers. Kwa hivyo kuna mabaharia wakua wao wanakashif mambo mengi lakini ni urongo mtupu. Kwa hivyo sisi tofanya kazi na sirikali na tuwashikuru rais ametafuta kazi kutuletia sisi wananchi wote wa Kenya. Kwa hivyo tuwaomba sisi tufanye pamoja na serikali. Hatuna ukabili. Hii kazi ileta kwa watu wote. They challenged the youth who have been employed in the shipping industry to exhibit discipline and be good ambassadors to attract other investors. Mabaria wengi wa mkwama, wa mkwenda wao kivyao, lakini chama kinshirikiana na ATF na serikali na watu wale wakarudi. <laughs>